Oh, look at that, Skullica bastard! Okay, which one we will not play for sure? We don't need two consumers. Um, wow, this is pretty bad. Wow, we might lose to the Skelliger because this is a terrible hand. I can technically draw a haunt. Ah, oh, me. Okay, Adam, for me, uh, time to leave for a meeting. Uh, it was good to see you back. Well, thanks for coming. Bye. Uh, well, I'll see ya. Until next time. Hello, played your deck yesterday, 0-5. Lol. Did you have fun? <laughs> uh, ask the chat. <laughs> ask the chat how successful I was with the deck. You can ask me because I might mislead you, but ask the chat. Was I successful? I can just tell you that it, it's a bit of a mixed bag. Sometimes we get wrecked, but ultimately I say that we have our win rates that kind of feels about like 70%-ish. Actually, I fucked up. Uh, get a little distracted here. Uh, this is not a good example game. I actually ran into quite a lot of players who are uh, playing this deck. I, I wanted to do uh, Matahari into a haunt. Uh, I guess that's not gonna be a thing anymore. So now we're just gonna do something like this. Or maybe a Matahari still. I might just boost the egg. I need the egg to stay up. I watched you yesterday and I saw you were winning a lot. I feel like opponents uh, weren't uh, 10,000 IQ as usual. What rank are we playing? <coughs> Unfortunately, I was uh, lowered in rank. Apparently, I'm at rank 8 now. It just takes forever to climb up. I didn't lose my rank. I was demoted for not playing. Wait, he's damaging everything in the back. I think we gotta go for a secondary win condition here. We might we may have to play Gloucester here. It seems like he's trying to line up my units. So I also tried it, but it didn't work. What well, at what, what rank you tried it? Maybe it's because of my rank. Apparently I'm playing against the biggest noobs of all time. <laughs> casual only. These casual guys are fucking savage.
this is not how we usually play. But this is my adjustment for making a misplay earlier. Might force him into at least committing something. Regis plus greatsword, I assume. It does seem like he's lining something up. Big ship. The good news is that he might think I'm a total noob and I don't even run the deck I'm running. Going for a long grant against the consume deck is actually pretty smart. This is a good combo. We need this. Fuck. We need to keep this for the next round. But if not, we might do a... Oh fuck, let's keep this. Okay. Yeah, he totally misunderstood my deck. Despite fighting very oddly. Maybe maybe that's, that's what... Uh, yeah. Surprised him. Like, look at this. Based on that, like, what the fuck am I running? <laughs> he has no idea. Some kind of a uh, short round consume deck, right? But of course he has self-damage. Or maybe he could have self-damage because he's Skellige. Of course he likes uh, long grants too. Starter monster consume deck. <laughs> Come on, give me some credit. So I'm gonna get that. I don't want to pug go. We can start with the Matahari. We might start with a Karen tier, noon raid, played into a Gals, or maybe a Matahari. I think Gals is fine. But that makes it very obvious what are we trying to do. So I think that's the way to go. I always bleed decks with this leader. It can be Kiki Queen, dominance deck also. Yeah, but you can't really dominate the rats. As long as we can fill up his board with trash, it, it's almost always good enough. The only way they beat me is if they have some huge guys. The more more units, more slots he fills up, the better it is for me. That's smart. I have enough to trigger Haunt later. Question is, do we Noon Raid? I mean, do we Gals now? Okay, let's Gals now. 
I mean, opponent should lead. Your leader often uh, runs some crazy combo. Yeah, but if you're running against a consume monster, like, the consume monsters often have a very strong short round. Like, imagine I, I finish with a Plague Maiden, consume it with Kairon. Then, like, do a Gusty into it. Like, do, do you really want that short round? I'm just making the argument that it's, it's not an obvious choice. I can play the bridge draw to try to protect Gauss. Or we just say, fuck yeah, let's do Noom Raid. But then we cannot protect Gauss. But this is so damn tempting. Hey, Grail. We're just wrecking this guy with rats, hopefully. So it does seem like we have four more rats that we can play uh, with the Merylorn and the K running the Noon Braid. But that's it. And we also have to play Matahari uh, to get out the haunt. And we have to play with the Bridge Tool and the Plague Maiden. What is average Gauss value today? It doesn't seem that good. Oh my god. But we don't. Possibly. But we don't really have too many other cards to consider. If anything, I would be more open to replace the Operator, because this is a card... I suppose Gals is kinda the same style as well, but I would be more eager to replace the Operator. But Operator still has a point. I'm open to solutions and uh, alternatives to this deck. If you guys can think of a better deck, but like, replace Gals in a way that actually makes the deck better. Because, okay, Gals is not the best, but what else you put in? Operator is the most nostalgic card and needs to be in every deck. <laughs> it does have the advantage that even if we have no one Noon Raid in the hand, which is the usual scenario, then we can do the Karantir combo basically. We, we just play a Noon Raid with a Karantir or we play a Noon Raid with, uh, with the Operator. And uh, it also has the advantage that it gives my opponent one unit. So, that actually fills their board, so it kind of fits fits the archetype, but this is like a strictly round 3 card. Although sometimes we just get an egg, and it's not terrible. And the egg is worth more for us than the opponent, but it's still not ideal, obviously. It even spam spams your opponent. It's just fun, I guess. I don't know. I'm, I'm open to upgrades, but... What, one of the most heartbreaking things was making this deck, because first of all, I made this deck, when I first made this deck, it was all about spamming good rats. It was, it was everything we did. And that didn't work. That didn't work. That failed spectacularly, because we needed a plan B. We needed a plan B and we needed a plan C. So, you can't just say like, oh my god, I'm gonna spam with rats and that's it. That doesn't work. Do I just eat that? No 
Okay. Wait, can he deal damage to himself? Oh, he can't. I swear, a lot of these Skellige units just can damage, can deal damage to anything for no fucking reason. They doesn't, they don't pay any price for it. They can just do it by default. He's lining me up. This allows us to consume again. Inconsistent Skellige text. As for usual. I, I'm just not... Don't really necessarily understand that... What logic they follow. Because some cards can hit anything. And others can just hit enemies. And you, you might think like, oh, there's some logic to it. But then, then you see like... Uh, I believe the reinforced trebuchet. No, no. Some kind of trebuchet. And like, holy shit, why can't that hit allies? But that's that's no realm. But again, like, that makes no fucking sense. If he play this, he's gonna play the guy that just thumps thumps one dude. That Jotun. Yeah, Jotun is getting less value technically, but it doesn't get too much value if it gets removed. I don't know why he's hitting the rats. I was under the impression that enemy unit. Okay, he's tr trying to play around my Glusty. Better play smart now. Yeah, I mean. Points wise, we are doing okay. Wait, what? Blood first, foul blood. Noise. Well, we gotta play Jotun. We, we start like playing all these guys. The Jotun is gonna be weaker. We're still gonna have a, a bomb with Glusty. Oh shit! Wait, what? Oh no, no, no. We're, we're good. You have to play a card now. Okay, let's K run in the back. Need this. And beat these two. Sixty-seven point lead. Do we play a glust in the end? Yes. Let's give him a play. How big is this Glusty? Anyone who can guess it... Who can guess this Glusty value? Who, who is good at math? So his last card is your then, and you lose. That's why we're playing on the other row. I guess. Oh shit. Would I lose to your then? Nah, we still win, right? 46, okay. Alright, let's see. 
Ha! Almost correct. Sumuno Skelliger unit. What do you need? Oh, the ship came down. Oh, he threw away his sword. Didn't they nerf the ship a little bit? Because it was too good. Oh, these guys are just derping with the ship. Alright, well played.